How about Brandon Boston getting some first half important minutes here for the Clippers. I think he's slowly developing into a pretty decent piece here for the Clippers. Oubre Jr. bounces inside to Martin. He's got the hoppers. He lays it up and in. Counted and a foul. That's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> Coffee inside. I'm assuming that was blocked up that high. It goes out of bounds last touch by. George draws a crowd. Throws it right to the hands of K.J. Mark. Power play here for the Sixers. Back to Martin. He can stuff it. And a running rebound secured by Harris in overdrive. Challenges George. Dumps it off to Martin who lays it in. The X factor is absolutely real. Martin now with six off the bench in six minutes. Hey, double team with him, but with Kawhi back on the floor. He'll get the double teams. PG open, knocks it down. More of a stagnant attack here for the Sixers. Downton's going to have to bail him out. It's Martin Jr. for three. And Zoo has the rebound. You mentioned it going in. Bamba for three. Downton for three. It's good. Maxi in the corner to Oubre Jr. Driven off the line by Powell. Payne, that unorthodox looking shot, rattles home. Payne now, 15 off the bench in 10 minutes. Flails his legs, doesn't get a whistle. Boston is back, Martin. Blocked from behind, another block by Coffey. The Clippers have numbers if they hurry. Plumley with the rebound, botches the handoff. Boy, a tough sequence. Oh, an even tougher one with Maxi. Oh boy, my goodness, what a sequence for the Clippers. Harris hasn't scored in the second half until that basket right there. Yikes, it is 99-85. Final long road trip of the year starts on Wednesday in Philadelphia. Inside punches it down. Or oh, the exclamation mark, K.J. Martin off the bench.